Hi folks and welcome to the Hillbilly Kitchen. Today we're making a delicious three ingredient cheese dip for your next party. You can serve it with just chips or you can make it the center of your party. And we're going to tell you how to do that. The dip is so easy. You start out with a 8 ounce block of cream cheese and just kind of spread it out in the bottom of your casserole dish so that you've got a layer of cream cheese in there. Mine's not soft enough. You might want to leave it sitting out for a while longer than I did to soften it up to make this a little bit easier. You could also stick it in your microwave or your oven because if it's pre-melted, it's not going to matter. We're going to put this in the oven and melt it all because there is nothing better than hot gooey cheese. <laughs> it kind of bakes the party. All right, that wasn't too bad. And once you get your cream cheese all spread out in the bottom there, then we're going to add a jar of salsa. Any kind of salsa you want. And I have kind of a small jar, but you could put a big jar in with this much cheese. And I'm going to use some with black beans and corn. You could also do just a regular jar of salsa and add some black beans and corn if you wanted to use a little jar of salsa and add some other stuff. But anyway, I've got a jar with black beans and corn. And you can do the big ones. This one is like a 15 ounce jar, you know, you can do the ones that are like that high. I don't know how much is in them. Anyways, just pour your salsa in on top of your cream cheese. Whether you use a big jar or a little jar, kind of spread that out. And then we are going to add two cups of shredded cheese. You can use mild cheddar, sharp cheddar, um, queso, taco, I'm using a four cheese Mexican blend, and this is two cups or an eight ounce package, and just put that on top of the salsa. And it is that simple. And then we're gonna put this in the oven until it is bubbly, a 350 degree oven. It'll take about 15 minutes for it to heat up and start getting bubbly. And that's it. Just in the oven until it bubbles. So let's get this stuck in the oven. Gosh, that was hard to make. I'm more out. <laughs> now, in about 15 minutes, this is what our super easy, super cheesy party dip looks like. You can serve this, like I said, with just your favorite chips and make it a part of other uh, things on your party buffet or just have it as a snack. Maybe if you're watching a movie or a football game or whatever kind of game you watch, you just want a snack and you've got a few friends over, just this dip and some chips would be wonderful. But if you're doing a big party, like you're doing a big Super Bowl get together, and you wanna make this the center of your buffet, you can add some shredded chicken with fajita seasoning, some shredded beef with taco seasoning, some chopped tomatoes, shredded lettuce, sour cream, you know, all the fixings, diced onions, maybe some jalapenos and stuff, and put out some tortilla shells and let people load those up and make that your whole buffet and have this melted, gooey, cheesy dip in the middle of it. Or you could serve this with the chips as part of a bigger buffet with some other party foods, some meatballs or barbecue sandwiches or little smokies or whatever you're doing with it. But this is really, really good and it's hot and in the wintertime, hot snacks and hot hors d'oeuvres and you know stuff that's just so much nicer i do want to show you this so you can see what this looks like down in here i mean look at that and the cheese just strings and you've got the cream cheese in the bottom it's just beautiful and like i said absolutely delicious you're never going to dip a chip in anything any better than this so whatever event you're planning if you just need a snack or if you're doing a big party Keep this one, save it, give it a try. It's good, you know, with just chips or as a centerpiece for a whole buffet. We're really close to the Super Bowl. We're also getting really close to Valentine's Day, obviously. <laughs> and this Valentine's Day 2024 is a very special day for the Hillbilly Kitchen. And I want to invite all of you to join us in a special live stream that we're going to be doing on Valentine's Day. 
And I know some of you have plans and some of you don't. If you don't have plans, please plan on join, joining us because we would like to share our special day with you and our celebration with you. Before we leave, I want to share 1 Corinthians 13, 13 with you. And now abide faith, hope, and charity, these three. But the greatest of these is charity, our love. Love is the greatest gift that God gave us. And because of love, He gave us His Son. Because of love, we have salvation. Because of love, we have bonds with our family, with our friends. Without love, we would not have a connection even with other people. And we certainly would not have a connection with our Lord. So forget about what people are saying about the commercialism of Valentine's Day and celebrate the love, the greatest thing. I wanna thank you so much for joining us in the Hillbilly Kitchen. If you haven't already, please don't forget to click like and subscribe before you leave. Share all of our videos with your friends. And until next time, remember to put God first.